going to be a lot of pink in downtown Indianapolis tomorrow, I right? I know. I, I saw I your can't come dress. tomorrow, so and I you decided. You were showing your spirit nice. today. I did it today. Yes. Excellent. And well, we're worried about uh, rain for tomorrow. No worries. Okay. We're going to get in that race tomorrow. We're talking race for the cure. And yep. You mentioned earlier you still have time to register if you want to come downtown That's be right. there at... Seven? Come at seven o'clock okay. and you can register the day of the race. And it's going to be a fun time. And it's going to be dry more importantly. And I've got another sign of summer being close. Hey. A time lapse of Morse Reservoir. And if you look closely, you're going to see a boat or two passing by. Now, I think it was a little too cool for a boat ride, but they might be getting the boats in the docks getting ready for summer. And it was a nice sunset over Hamilton County. Right now over Indianapolis, we have 50 clear skies and a west wind at 10. Today's high 63, our low this morning 48, 16 hundredths of an inch of precipitation. But I will caution you, several areas picked up several inches of rain. We have creeks, streams, rivers all running high. If you live near one, keep that in mind. They're going to be running high for the next several days. No rain right now. Skies are clear and will stay that way overnight. What's highlighted in pink, southern sections of Wisconsin, northern parts of Illinois, that's a winter storm warning. They're forecasting several inches of snow. None of that for us. Some sunshine as we kick off our Saturday. And we'll do so in the 40s. A midday temperature in the 50s. Clouds will be on the increase tomorrow afternoon. And we can time the arrival of the rain with future track 13. It is not going to be here tomorrow morning. Clouds will continue to thicken. It'll be late afternoon, early evening that we get that better chance for some rain. And some of that could be heavy at times, especially tomorrow night and into the early part of Sunday. We may squeeze out a few thunderstorms. And on the back side, maybe a few flakes of snow. All of this moves out for the end of the weekend. But we're going to be on the cooler side of things. Temperatures close to 60 tomorrow and again on Sunday. But Sunday, the sunshine returns, and that's how we will end the weekend. So a few showers tomorrow, especially late in the day. 60, some sunshine near 60 Sunday. Active weather pattern next week. That means a daily chance for rain. Temperatures in the 60s and 70s through next week. All right. Thanks, Angela. Sounds pretty good. Yeah, I love that.